so much hair so why we <laughs> hey guys thanks for tuning in if you want to see how i installed this tea lace wig like a frontal stay tuned and keep on watching hi guys so you can see i already braided her hair and this is uh the cap which i'm using to do her bowel cap makeup i have a video detailedly showing you guys how to do bowel cap makeup although i'm just going to show you just a little bit on this video okay after spraying this uh, goes to be spray i did i actually went and i saw the back part of the cap when after it was dry I cut the extra leaves. So I was just adding this uh, bolt hole active at the ends of the, the, the wig cap so that it should blend with her skin. And then I'll go ahead and put makeup. Make sure you put the makeup when the when the glue is dry so that it doesn't stick <laughs> on your brush so putting the makeup is just for it to look like your scalp make sure you put makeup which is close to her skin tone so this was a I got that makeup from Taobao and this is a wig we are working with she actually got it on WeChat from what was that Vicky yeah she sent it without anything i had to bleach it and because it, it it's a tea lace wig they don't have enough lace at the sides the lace is just at the middle but she wanted some she wanted a front but she sent her a tea lace wig i don't know if you guys know the tea lace wig tea lace means the laces are just at the middle part and then the side is just just a little bit of lace it's not as big as how it used to be because of shortage of lace in china and the prices are extremely expensive so yeah if you see any tea lace week on the ma in the market or at on aliexpress just know that's what is available in china right now tea lace week so i always use three coats of boho active and let it dry then stick the lace in f on her forehead where it's supposed to be always uh, ask the client to help you hold the sides of the lace so that it should stick on her ear part so that it doesn't move when you are trying to fix the other part okay and this hair is a little bit difficult to to glue because of the fact that the hair was the lace is a tea lace so we are actually gluing the bundles on on her hairline not actually a, a, a closure or a lace wig or let's say a frontal or the lace so what we are actually doing at the side is actually have her bundles the bundles sewn on the hair the lace the, the the portion where the lace is is only at the center of the head of her wig not at the side i know you guys don't understand i'm just going to insert a picture right now so you see what i'm talking about the side of the hair has no lace no frontal lace it has just a little bit but the middle part has it so after press uh, putting the lace on her forehead i'll cut the extra lace at her ear tab and then i will proceed with um, melting down the lace 
put the elastic band so that the glue should stick on her hair and then i'll go ahead and trim her wig because she said she wanted like a blonde blonde look like actually i will show you guys what i did to her hair so after tying that i actually created the part she wanted the middle part so i'll i use my hot comb hair wax and holding spray to actually create the part so wash as i'm doing it so i really enjoyed her, <laughs> her conversation because she was telling me a, a lot about how to know people from america like how to know who is from texas how to know who is from miami and all of that i didn't know there was a difference in that like because she was saying it, at her workplace the chinese said her accent is not an america she doesn't sound america so she was like you don't you guys know there are so many parts of america like there are people from other sides of america like someone from miami someone from atlanta from someone from georgia like they have like their own kind of uh how to speak their own english so they shouldn't judge people from what from their accent they should judge people from like their how they say it from if they can speak english or not so proceeding i had to cut her hair and then flat iron it so that she can get this the look which she wanted So before now i had already flat ironed her hair strand to strand so you don't think you have to you don't think when you want to flat iron your hair you pick bigger portions like that no you have to make sure you flat iron it strand to strand and then before you proceed in cutting and then you 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 you, you, you give her this cur these curves <laughs> guys ignore my blabbing ignore it and try to get the point okay Thank you so much for liking this video and subscribing to my channel. Yeah, so I, after all this, I had to cut the extra lace and then uh, take out the baby hairs. So the baby hairs just depend on how you, how, how you like it. Like I said, this is a tea lace. There's no the, the 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 hair on the lace is not so much. So I just wanted to get maybe a little bit of hair because I didn't pluck the the the, the hairline because there wasn't anything at this on the lace to pluck. So just to camouflage it to look like a frontal, I had to take it take out a little bit of hair and then cut it and then um. I'll spray my how do they call it got to be spray to give it the melt down and then put her under the dryer 10 minutes later I will cut the baby hair and style it yeah after styling the baby hairs i used my hand dryer to dry the ghost to be gel because i didn't use mousse not anything i used gel 
so i'm just going to let it dry and then yeah proceed in styling the wig again look how natural these baby hairs are so i'll add a little bit of um makeup to define the part because she wanted the middle part i have to define the part with makeup and then add some other some powder to make it look more much more natural This is like what I like doing, I like putting my hand, pushing my hair behind my ears. So guys this is the end of the video. Let me know if you like this video and also check my other videos and playlist which is week install one one oh one. Let me know what if you like this video by liking this video give me a thumbs up click the subscribe button and also share with your friends and families if you want to see any other video let me know in the comment section below and also let me know what you think thanks and see you in my next video bye